In this video, we're going to look at one of two theories about acids and bases. And the first one we're going to look at is called the Arrhenius theory. And uh, this theory describes that uh, acids are substances that dissolve in water to create hydrogen ions, or H+. So two examples. First one is hydrochloric acid, breaks up into H+, and Cl-. And our second example, we've got sulfuric acid breaking up into 2H+, and SO4-2. Just to point out here, we need this equation to balance. Over on this side, we have two hydrogens, so that's why we need a 2 in front to give us two hydrogens. Uh, and over here, we have one sulfate. And on the right side, also one sulfate. You'll notice that our charge is also balanced. On the left side of our equation, there's no charge to sulfuric acid. And over on this side, we have two positives and two negatives. And of course, those neutralize each other. And so the right side of our equation also has a charge of nothing. When it comes to bases, Arrhenius said that uh, compounds are bases if they dissolve to produce hydroxide ions. So an example could be sodium hydroxide. It dissolves into sodium plus and OH minus. So a couple of problems with, uh, with this theory, though. Uh, the first problem is that uh, Arrhenius figured that water must be included in these reactions. And there's a couple of examples here showing that that's not the case. And uh, number two, perhaps even more importantly, is that uh, OH doesn't always happen. For instance, if you put NH3 here in H2O in water, it's going to be basic. But clearly, NH3 has no hydroxide ions in its formula, so uh, you cannot explain what's going on here with the Arrhenius theory. So you need a second theory, and we'll talk about that in the next video. Thank you for watching my video. Uh, please subscribe to my channel.